In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. A reading from St. Paul's letter to the Hebrews. It was essential that Christ should in this way become completely like his brothers, so that he could be a compassionate and trustworthy high priest of God's religion, able to atone for human sins. That is, because he has himself been through temptation, he is able to help others who are tempted. The Word of the Lord. If you're anything like me, you may have, possibly on more than one occasion, felt like God has abandoned us. We are living through such a difficult time and so many people are finding lockdown three so much harder than the first lockdown in the spring. It would be easy for us to say, where is God in all of this? Why hasn't God helped us out of this situation? But it is in these moments that we must remind ourselves of what St. Paul said in our reading today. Christ knows exactly what we are going through and is very close to us. Jesus became completely like us in our humanity and knows what it means to go through trials and suffering. But Jesus taught us that even in these times, in the face of difficulty, God is good and he is with us. Let us pray. Lord Jesus, you became completely like us in our humanity, fragile and vulnerable, not exempt from human suffering. You teach us to trust the goodness of God even in these challenging times. May we become more like you, growing in patience, peace and virtue, using this time of trial to grow in strong in faith and bold in prayer. We make this prayer through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.